Hello and welcome to today's CNC Talk. For hundreds of years, the hidden side of the moon has inspired the human imagination. In the fictional worlds depicted by sci-fi writers and filmmakers, the far side of the moon is where aliens house their military bases and space refugees strive to live. The far side of the moon was first observed by a Soviet spacecraft in 1959. Since then, it has been observed many times from lunar orbits, but never explored at surface level. At the beginning of 2019, a Chinese spacecraft made history by touching down on this secret and barren land after a 26-day journey. The feat amazed space experts and enthusiasts from around the world. The spacecraft landed on the moon's unexplored South Pole Aitken Basin. This is the largest impacted structure throughout our whole solar system caused by a massive collision around 4 billion years ago. The mission, named Chang'e 4, was held a complete success by China. One of the highlights came when the lander and the rover named Jade Rabbit 2 took pictures of each other on Friday. The data was transmitted back to Earth by a relay satellite. According to the China National Space Administration, all scientific equipment has functioned well and the data has been received by ground control. And scientific experiments are underway and going smoothly. A congratulatory message sent by the Communist Party of China Central Committee, the State Council and the Central Military Commission writes that the success of Chang'e 4 is another contribution to mankind's exploration of the mysteries of the universe. And it also shows Chinese people reaching new heights at the forefront of science and technology in the new era. NASA Administrator Jim Bridenstine tweeted about the success, saying congratulations to China's Chang'e 4 team. This is a first for humanity and an impressive accomplishment. A Chinese archaeologist wrote, It reminds me of an ancient inscription which carved the tales of Chang'e, a goddess who flies to the moon from Earth. Today's space mission is a continuation of the romance and bravery carried in the tales. The achievement has come after years of hard work. China's lunar exploration program began in 2004 and it was named Chang'e after the goddess of the moon depicted in Chinese legend. Years of trials and tribulations by Chinese space scientists have made it possible, as they believe 10,000 minus 1 means 0, meaning that any minor mistake would lead to the failure of this mega project. The Chang'e 4 probe also showcases the importance of international cooperation in space exploration, carrying scientific equipment developed by the Netherlands, Germany, Sweden and Saudi Arabia. As the plan for the fourth phase of the lunar exploration program is drawn up, China is seeking greater international cooperation. As Sun Zhou, chief designer of the Chang'e 4 probe said, and I quote, It's our common goal to improve human understanding of the moon and the universe. The collaboration will benefit all participants.